Hey guys, it's Jimmy here, and welcome back to another Dragon Ball video. Hopefully, you're having a great morning because we just got a new event, the actual Bountiful Picnic in Dragonville. And today, we're gonna check out everything new in this event, so let's get right into it. The so first up, we got the new event and actually the rewards. I will say some of the rewards are actually kind of funny. They got like two new dragons that are pretty cool. One of them's actually more just funny than more than anything else. So we got onto the picnic area. We got this new like a uh, chip, a uh, chip dragon. It's literally just a cookie dragon. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of looks like a little fatty and I kind of like that about him, but not particularly a huge fan of this design, but I kind of like it just because how like derpy it is. You know, it feels like if you took a chip a whole cookie and slapped it into a dragon, this is what you'd get. I don't know. Maybe that's just a me thing at least. And we also got this other dragon, which is pretty cool. It's kind of like um, a porcupine dragon thing. I don't know what it's supposed to be in all fairness, but hey, it's pretty nifty. And on top of that too, we got one more dragon, which is the glider dragon, which is kind of a sugar glider. It's like if you took a sugar glider, made a dragon, that's what you get from this. But uh, yeah, I think my favorite two dragons from this event so far are definitely like the glider dragon and like the chip a chip dragon. I'm definitely like saying its name wrong, but I'm gonna call it chip ahoy dragon just for the time being, just for jokes. But quick question for you guys, if you had to pick which of these three dragons, which is your favorite, let me know in the comments down below. I think personally for me, my favorite dragon from this event is the glider dragon just because that cool looks but i'll be curious to see what you guys say in the comments but besides that though we actually got some new rewards like actually cherry petals which of course you can place that around your park we also got like some returning stuff like the lost island and some of the habitats and also uh you know the gemstone rewards so you can now buy the gemstone habitat if you really want to i'm pretty sure i bought the max maladies actually no i have not bought the max maladies three of them so you know what i'm doing i'm about a more gemstone habitat so you want to buy that go for it which i'm definitely going to do and if you don't have the last already, you can get it that way too. So that's pretty cool from this event. You can get that stuff. And on top of that, we do actually got a little daily reward up to, what is it? 31 days. So pretty much till the end of this month for April or something like that. I think it's going to be like April 29th, but we'll check afterward. But of course, you'll be able to claim dragons from previous events with that last reward. Just because we can tell because it's dragon eggs, which will be pretty cool. Uh, but now we also got ourselves the classic games. We got name that dragon. We got wheel chance, dragon drop, and name that dragon egg. And of course, if you were to complete these games by completing all five of them, you'll have an opportunity to pay five gems to actually play another game. And of course, if you pay five gems to play another game and then you complete it, you can actually get some stuff from it, like food, uh, was it gold, gems, and some other stuff. I don't know about like decorations and some other things, because sometimes with these kind of games, they actually give you like decorations, actual dragons for completing it, and some other stuff too. And I can't believe I actually just got that wrong right there. I'm like rusty on Dragonville, so like I'm not surprised. But I don't think we'll be getting any dragon rewards, but uh, if you guys do get anything like dragon eggs, gems, let me know in the comments down below or decorations even. So that way we at least keep the community updated. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, I can't believe I messed up that one. I have no idea what this dragon is. I, mean, I think it's like this one. Oh, Sprite. Okay. I've not seen that dragon. That's a new one to me. And of course, we have a little event area where, of course, you can put your dragons together with friends. They actually pair them up, match the elements. And of course, to complete it, you will get some stuff from that that way. But that's practically about it, though. They did actually bring back the, uh, what is it called? Runic Caves. And this is probably one of the features of the dragon that's my least favorite, but also it's kind of cool. So if you guys do not know how it works, you can bring dragons together. And of course, if you were, like, let's say, for example, bring my dark dragon with our these two things and if we were to complete this actual like breed if it lets me speed it on up that is so yeah if we were like to speed this on up here i could have just waited a minute but i'm just gonna do it for the time being you'll actually get to collect your dragon as a bonus reward like poof we got a dragon and of course more dragons you breed for this actual cave within the time span of being seven days you of course can see how many dragons you get so for example here let's say i have multiple fire dragons if i was to claim one of these dragons i can do so so i'm going to use one claim left and i would only be able to claim one actual dragon from this actual cave and i wouldn't be able to claim anymore so that's problem with these runic cave or not runic cave yeah runic cave it's just one of those things that's like cool you can bring a bunch of dragons with it but you can only claim one of the dragons from the runic cave they actually keep which is kind of my least favorite feature of the game but if you're wondering how it works that's how it works okay so the event runs through may 5th but doesn't officially end till later so if i was to actually go to unused eggs it says runs till may 8th okay so this event will end on may 5th but then you'll be able to use any leftover currency until may 8th and then if you don't use any of it all of it will be converted into dragon cash by like a thousand per egg so just something to keep in mind but yeah this is a new event i will just say this though i think the new event is nifty nothing too insane nothing that really stands out or impressed me i will say though it's kind of funny that we got like this chip ahoy dragon and the sugar glider dragon and that's 
practically about it though i think everything else in this event's like pretty okay but yeah when you guys enjoyed this event let me know in the comments down below if you like it dislike it and uh what's your favorite dragon for this event and if you guys enjoyed my video here today make sure to smash like button get subscribed so i miss some future videos and i'll see you guys when i want you man